I fulfilled my criteria, quote my quota for work today, so I'm just gonna play more Zelda now. So I actually I'm actually facing a bit of a conundrum right now. On one hand, I really want to do the Lionel Weapons Only Challenge. On the other though, I want to continue doing my playthrough. I only have one hour before it's literally the next day. It's 23 o'clock right now. So if I do decide to start a new game, uh, I'll only have one hour to do all the Great Plateau. And you know, I haven't set up my mods and saves to be disabled, uh, my mods and other shit to be disabled yet, so that I can do a vanilla enough playthrough. Of course, I like my Lenko mod too much, and I will be keeping it for the challenge. <laughs> And any other playthrough I make of this game. As long as I still do the Gerudo side quest rather than just straight up ignoring it. <laughs> It'll be vanilla enough. Uh, well, I'm just doing the Karak quests. I hate these. I don't actually, I don't... It's been a while since I've done them. It's... Shmish Hero! Yay! Right, completing all the side quests and shrine quests here is easy enough and quick enough to do, well, relatively speaking, since everything can be found in this one very small area, one very laggy area in the base game, but still nice. Okay, well, it's laggy here too, apparently, as it turns out. Toriu's here, what the hell? It's so late now. I'm guessing we're gonna be going to the voice chat or something. What was that? I saw... I saw Simu just now. On Discord. Could I have streamed it? Because if I can stream it, that means I can record it as well. In window capture mode rather than game capture mode. Amazing. Or you got an emulator for a Game Boy so that he can play a modded version of Pokemon Red and Green. Uh, the one that lets that replaces all the Pokemon with Moe. I mean, I would be a hypocrite if I said something about it. Oh yeah, the Leviathan Bones. There's still one I've yet to find. The last one is in Hebra somewhere. If I explore hard enough, I'll find it eventually. Oh, I won't bother right now. Alright, let's see. There's some nice stuff here. I'll buy some of your stuff. Mushrooms are nice. Mushrooms, hell yeah. yeah. Stamina, yeah. not really all that useful. 
I'll take the heartbeat truffle. Yep, I'll buy everything but this Tamela. Right, we're off. What? What? There's a way to get... What? There's an exit here? I've always just thought there, the only way to get out was by teleporting. Namely shrines. Right, uh, I should go, I wanna go take a picture of that bloopy real quick. There's a whole bunch of them in Bubinga Forest for some reason I remember. So. Let's go do that quick. Okay, and now once again the Sheikah armor's fixed and looking just fine and normal and dandy. Ugh, I'll never understand why things are things and that stuff is stuff. Hmm. I get the Karak mask. You know, this isn't really much of a mask, isn't it? Unless there is supposed to be like a mask and... For some reason, the mod's not showing it. I like it without the mask, though. Yeah, it's highly unlikely that's the case, honestly, though. Actually. Alright, Hikali Woods, I mean. That's where we're actually supposed to go. And if I remember correctly, there's supposed to be a Karak seed here. Fuck off! quick spin. It's not worth it. <laughs> In my opinion. I swear I used to be able to do it more consistently as well. Uh, but again, I, all, I still never really did it all that much. Uh, wow, there's... Oops.
fuck, I'm wasting my durability and killing... Killing insects. Just being a general dick to nature. Oh yeah, I was gonna craft something, a weapon in the crafting bullshit. See what I could make. Feathers, give me. I want feathers for arrows. Not that I really need any more. Oops, what may as well. Oh, there's a bloopie. Try getting a good clean shot of this guy. Face this way. Perfect. Of course, this picture. Anyway, sure, I'll replace it with the new one. Uh, do I still have the Zora spear? Well, the drill shaft will do, I guess. Ba -ba 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 -ba. I missed. I'm a, I'm an embarrassment. What's in here? Purple ruby. Cool. Right, back to the car off forest I go. Right, three challenges, three trials total. Or shrines. Blah. Actually forget crafting a weapon. I need to make space. Actually, I have enough space for everything, but let me get rid of my duplex bow. And let me continue that kid's quest. Uh, frick me and my teleporting happy nature. Always getting distracted and always getting. Look at us, we're hot. Mm. Mm. I got your duplex bow. Let me show ya. Beat your eyes. Uh, the Yiga used these weapons. They let you fire two bow, two arrows, at once. Pretty nifty. I don't really like it though. The angles of both shots are pretty annoying. And also, you know, they belong to the Yiga. With another ego weapon. <laughs> uh. Right, let's not get rid of anything or craft anything for that matter. 
Because there's a trial that requires us to have at least one slot for everything. There's also a mission where we got a stealth, which is why I'm wearing this. But honestly, I don't remember what the third one is. I don't remember much about this place in general. Uh, we should dress as Tingle for that challenge, that seems fitting. What does Tingle give us? Night speed up. This thing's supposed to give night speed up as well. Also, it disguises you from pretty much all enemies, just like the Majora's Mask. And since it's upgradable here, that means I have even less reason to wear the Majora's Mask than I already have. Alright, let's not waste stamina by jumping. I already got the speed up. Alright, there's actually something at the top of the Drake Deku tree. So let's do this. Oh, fairies. Give me... Stop going higher! Get down here! Damn you, whatever. If you're here, does this mean you fa want to face the ultimate trial? Sure. Ahem, the ultimate trial has begun. I'll tell you a riddle about an object. Your job is to solve the riddle and bring me the correct object. Here comes your first riddle. Small, red, rounded, sweet. Bring me one of this simple treat. Have you figured it out? I'm guessing you're more stumped than the base of a felled tree. Place the right object on the leaf, I'll dance for you. Alright, uh, we just gotta drop some shit. Oh, hey, look, a rusher. Alright, the first one's simple and uh, obvious enough, at least to me. I actually forgot what all the items are, but the first one's definitely an apple. That's it, that's it! You got it! The next riddle is... Kakariko Village is specialty fruit. It's rock hard, flesh is quite resolute. Shit, that's pumpkin. I have no pumpkin. How do I not have any pumpkin? I don't want to climb back up here. Go to Kakariko then. I have some space in my inventory. Let me go do that quest. I should really just focus on getting all the armors. First, which is to say, I should focus on shrines. Here I am, though. 
Alright, I need some pumpkins. a young lady like you in a village like this. You aren't part of the Eagle Clan, are you? I'm just pulling your leg. You look so serious, I couldn't help but go you a bit. Like all those who swear allegiance to Calamity Ganon and the Eagle Clan, they... Well, let's just say they don't take kindly to those who would stand against Ganon. Seems they're active again, ever since that big earthquake the other day. Don't worry, I don't think you're part of that awful Eagle Clan. I can figure that much out just by looking at you. Please don't hold it against me. Here, take this in exchange. Cool. What if I had pumpkins or Kakariko Village's specialty? I put my heart and soul into every one of them. They're delicious. If you want more, I can give you some. Just stop by the fields and say hello. Give me all of them. This is actually the only place you can get fortified pumpkin. I am you I do have a duplex bow that's kind of their signature weapon All right, I should go talk to the guy that likes to hang around here so I can get the rest of the ability controls unlocked spin attacking and sneak striking this seem like he's here right now whatever Today's the nurse veggie cream soup. Super nourishing and fortifying. Well, that's what they say anyhow. It must be true. All you do is toss swift carrot, rock salt, and fresh milk in a pot and stew it up and voila, so yummy. Oh no. Dr. Coco is all out of swift carrots. The cocoa product can make cause some hasty veggie food. I'll give you some. I can't believe they made a song for cooking. Dang it. Hold on. if I buy these? All of them? I might need these too. Where did you get the guts for of Bokos, lady, by the way? You're selling them. Like, that's actually crazy. No goat water, I knew it. Take it.
Let me eat this real quick. What do you need? Meat? Kindly. What do you need, honey? Lucky for you. I got one. They're pretty annoying to get. Honestly, not worth it. All they do is give you stamina when you cook them. And not the yellow stamina. Ah. Just sell those actually. Sorry, kid. Free money. What's a cook? What am I missing? I need stamina. <laughs> Food. Or speed boost. Food. Carrot, save up on the ingredients. There we go. I believe I need, yep, the last one I need is cold resistance. Simple enough. Alright, I got the pumpkin now. Hopefully I have everything else too. There's a shrine you can get by completing every side quest in Kakariko. Anyway, I want to see a pumpkin. Whoa. Voila! This salty shroom will warm your bones, it makes its home in warmer zones. Uh, I believe that's a sun shroom.
Lunch room, that's it. <laughs> its scales and tail will zap you, no doubt. This shocking swimmer is called a fish. Sh shit. Wait. I might have it. Boltvin trout. Yeah, yeah. Lucky. I actually had some Vulcan. I thought I didn't have any. This is the last one. If stepped on by this, you will go poof. It starts with an H and ends with an O. You're joking. You wanted me to kill a Lionel. For that stu- for this stupid riddle. Bruh. Worth it question mark? Hell yeah. How does it feel to be bastard? For well, I am the master of puzzles. Anyway, take this. Money. Right, all that's left are the trials now. Right, let's go to this side first. See what's here. Frog, frog. As long as I follow this road, well, it's not really a road, but close enough. Should take me to where I want to go. Try another Korok leaf. I don't need to. Once a crowd. And two's a party. Hmm, is this... This is the way to the middle one. Oh, whatever. Didn't really matter which one I do first. Car off leaves. Pop. I just wanted to do another quick spin. Dang it. Let me do a quick spin. I know you can do it mid combo. I believe in you, Link. Man, frog, fuck. It appears I made a complete circle. How about I go here? This looks like it leads somewhere.
Oh, you, you're Miss Hero, right? You're gonna do the car up trial, yes, yes? Yeah? I knew it. I'd like to ask you a favor, Dad. A little Oki just now set off to do the car up trial. Normally I'd go along too, but Oki insisted in going alone. I let Oki go, but well, I'm just getting worried. Could you please follow Oki without being seen? I want to be sure nothing bad happens. Ah, dang it. This one first. Alright, luckily I've memorized his fucking route. And I've got max stealth. So I don't have to worry too much about getting caught by sound. As long as I don't get too close. Or start running and doing other stupid bullshit loud shit like jumping and attacking and running. Sure do. Stupid mandatory stealth bullshit. It's just me or he really hard to see right now. Extra hard to see even. Alright, there's like a section where he gets super scared and turns around. When that happens, we need to be sure we're hiding somewhere. Or else he'll see us at- Ah, oh, fuck, I'm sniffling. Hold on. Tree breath. Don't bother with that. Where did he go? I lost sight of him. Just some stupid sticks. I believe it's somewhere around here in the halfway point. Right here should be a good spot. Or not. Here we go. There you go. Not gonna bullshit me like last time. I know your game. No, shit! Mm. 
Uh, fuck. Fuck that noise. I'll go back to Gerudo. Alright, there's... There's a shrine around here. Let me do that one. And there's also a... A shrine here. It's related to a shrine quest. Almost every shrine here is related to a quest, honestly. too cold soon enough. Me, they're everywhere. Okay, then, uh, I'll travel at daytime then. one and then uh oh, they fit really nice with each other I think we might be needing level two yeah let's go with this we've got a measly 14 defense uh, but this armor set make uh, this armor mod makes every defense so low anyway already. this thicket of a desert bullshittery. I'm just gonna be dropping this. I really hate the duplex bow. Let me use this. attack up. There's gonna be a fight. We may as well fight these guys. I wanna fight them. I can take them on. Alright, here we are. Alright, 
Take care of the watchtower bitches first. Some good old electro shock Yarosh. Yeah, Freeze them. I don't think they have any wooden weapons they can use against me if I set things on fire. So, uh. Bye bye. Trying to get their weapons back now. Ah. Our victory. A Gerudo spear with long throw, huh? Well, here's what I think of that bullshit. Bam. Still pretty awkward, I guess, but... Another Royal Broadsword. This one's got mods. Steerbill, uh, attack up. Got attack up. This one's just normal. This one too is only normal. Mm. The attack up's nice, but they don't have that much durability and stuff, and throwing them such a pain in the ass. Yeah, I'll go get the durability up one. Take one of their bows. Actually, I can take two of their bows. Right, that's everyone accounted for. Ah, oh, it's both the max durability too, so that's pretty handy. I don't really use the Karak Leaf all that much, apart from the occasional. I'll get rid of it. Hopefully I won't regret it. <laughs> I 
their utility becomes less and less prominent the later you get on the game, as it turns out. No Wi-Fi. Right, here's the shrine. There we go. Solving this should get rid of the sandstorm. in this part of the map electric path ah this one's very long but very doable right, how long until my stuff regenerates four minutes one and a half one luckily we got this supposed to do is bring that but uh well this is impractical ah it works moonlight scimitar with durability up no thanks don't need it Things can't be moved. Not my shield. No, no. I dropped my shield. Give this fucking thing to me. Nose really sucks. No, come back. Dang it. I can make it. Yeah. I 
hey, there's treasure there. Beyond that, is there? Cool, apparently, this is the best shield for shield surfing. Wow, yeah, what the hell? <laughs> got literally no friction. Shrine floors are usually not very good for shield surfing, but wow, that thing, this thing sleds, slides, ugh. I don't think there's anything else much left here. See or do. Let me do let me do the sand surfing minigame bullshit. Also related to a shrine quest. Is that a car off? No, that's a rusty weapon. Yeah, what the hell is this? Why is this so fucking amazing? Why are you such a fucking bitch? Another one. Normal arrows will do. Alright, headshotting them is really bad. Guess, yeah, that happens. Oh, yeah, I should be on the lookout for Volt Fruit. Those bad boys. Did it in what? Oh, you're a fire. Didn't think you guys showed up here too. It makes a lot enough sense. more punishment can this thing take? Yep. Alright, well I guess this is my dedicated shield surfing bullshit now.
I've been sleeping on the Radiant Shield. This thing's fucking amazing. For no apparent reason. Look at her with that afro. She's fucking amazing. I don't think that that Ira, that hair is very aerodynamic and helps with anything. Go. The Chargers appear to take on the Gerudo Sassy race, apparently one who does not mind risking life and limb. But will our current record fall, the one set by our undefeated champion? The incomparable beast of the desert, the Sassy is ready to ride. New contestant reached the goal in less than one minute thirty while still passing under every arch. The suspense has killed me. I'm going to start the countdown. Alright, this is easy enough. Tried to mess with you for some reason. They just let these things slide and get away with doing all this bullshit. I guess it's exciting. Oh, I'm 17.81. It's a a new record! Ooh. Perfect. I believe this belongs to you. This trophy is something special, you know. Our champions have passed down a legend about it for 10,000 years. The legend goes, when the holy jewel is offered onto the pedestal, the chosen one will be granted the new power. But that power has never been granted to anyone. Not even to me, obviously. And yet I sense a power emanating from you, the likes of which I have never felt in anyone else. You should give it a shot. <laughs> and so a new champion is born. Solid riding. Oui? Yeah. 
The chap you're talking to someone besides me. I must admit, I'm a little jealous. Oh, I guess you're the new champion now. There's a legend shared among sand seal races that the grand trophy is the key to finding an ancient treasure. That's a load of seals, not if you ask me. Shrine, baby! Give me that look like nothing out of the ordinary has happened. Is that a shrine? I didn't think it had actually happened, but... Ooh. Well, if it takes someone like you destined for greatness to beat me, then it really is kind of an honor. <sighs> Hang on now, Tally. Don't act like this isn't a big deal. Just watching knock the breath right out of me. I'm sure I lost three years off my life from the stress, too. Just three years? Uh -huh. What are you trying to say? Ooh. Well, that may have taken three years off my life, but now I've got a new goal. Training Tally to defeat the new champ. I won't rest until Tally has pulled off her big comeback and reclaimed the title of Racing Champ. Now then, enough chip chat. If you want to ride, you'll have to pay the 100 rupees. No discounts, even for a champ. Some other time. Why, are you scared? Well, let me know when you're willing to show off that great riding. I can't wait. Righto! That's gonna have to do it for this episode. I'm going to bed. It's a blessing shrine. What's it gonna be? There's a joke to be made here. I, uh... Hey, it's got 100 points more. <laughs> One use more. And the other one. Amazing. Ninety out of one twenty shrines are getting real close. <laughs>